high Brent Tech here where tech is made simple. Just a quick video to let you know that if you are one of the many Gmail users that Google announced yesterday on the 29th of April, that it's now rolling out the ability for you to react to emails with emojis. And they mentioned that this new feature will allow you to quickly respond, acknowledge receipt of an email, and express yourself more authentically according to Google, who also says emoji reactions provide an expressive and personalized way of responding to emails. Now how this all will work is if we head into an email, you'll see here next to the reply and forward buttons, add reaction. You click on that and here's two I've recently used. I was just testing this out before posting. So let's just add another one or two and you get the idea. So and here you can see that it has only received one reaction in each of those emojis. Now if I head over to my other device from where I sent the email, just to show you that if I react from that side, so I'm just going to click on both of those and we're going to refresh the page just to get that to sync. And here we can see that two people now have reacted with that emoji. So I've basically just clicked on those emojis from Gmail on my other device. And I'm not really an emoji person, but I think if you are using Gmail a lot, this may be a nice move in the right direction. And just something just to take note of is that Google says that reactions cannot be sent as a response if an email was received via a Google group email alias or if there is a Google group on the recipient list. So those are the two scenarios where you cannot use emojis. And if I want to click that more than once, it'll tell me you have already reacted with that emoji or that emoji so you just get the general idea and the rollout pace for this is starting the 29th so that should be completed by the end of may across the board so it is on a gradual rollout and the availability is over and above google workspace customers and individual subscribers also available to personal Google account users like myself. So go check it out if you are using Gmail and obviously like to use emojis in different situations. There are quite a lot of these. I mean, you are not limited for choice, as you can see. And you can also search for them in the search. So there you go. Go check it out. Just wanted to keep you guys posted if you are using Gmail. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.